show you these are the brackets. This is the outside bracket. We left this extra room here. That's for the doors when they roll up. Poles will actually be out here. So your roll up door can come up here. It doesn't interfere. On the inside, you don't have to worry about it. So we just made enough room for a two by four. This is just two inch strapping. I think it's eighth inch thick metal. Just heated it up and bent it over. This is about six inches right here. About two inches on the side here and about two inches on this side. Drilled a hole, use a lag screw and a washer there. So I mean, you can basically build these however you want. Some people have used galvanized poles and uh, like fence hangers that you'd use on a wooden fence. So this is just something that we came up with and get it kind of centered up with the other ones that we measured out. We can see them through the tarp there, get them pretty centered. And Man, and these things will lift up and out so we can get our tractors in when we go to till the high tunnel. That's just it. We've got enough room for the got enough room for the tarp to move, to roll up in there. We'll do the other one, then we'll go through and we'll put our lag screws in. We need one of these pilots for to have a lag hook. Our wires can put on to shut the door. What we do is just pilot, drill some pilot holes already that's going to go in between each one of these. So we got these, we got a big socket, it kind of fits in there, but not all the way snug. And it just helps you put it in. So you just want to have enough, at least for your finger to go in, make sure that that rope will go right in there. All right, here we're putting the, the wire on the doors. The plans, manufacturer actually sends you rope, which didn't last in our wind, but maybe a day or two. So we went with eighth inch braided metal, stainless coated wire, which is 3 16 after the coating. And so we run that through there and we got extra big lag screws. It works really well. We've had it on our other high tunnels over there for three years now since we replaced it, replaced the rope and they're doing really well.